I want you to expand a little bit upon what you said when you said Obama is the worst thing. You spoke fast, so I'm not going to give you the exact words you said, but you said it was the, the worst thing next to crack. Being, the cold, being the cold, I, said the cold, I said the coldest drug that America dropped on blacks since crack. There you go. See, you said it beautifully. But what what did you mean by that? Like, what what makes you say that just in a general sense or even a specific thing? People, people was just, people was, people was, People were literally getting high. It was, it was like, a, 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 it was like you could even you could even have a, a logical discussion or debate in regards to what was going down with it. You know what I'm saying? They were really getting uh, literally getting high. Um, you talk to them. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't was basically uh, no, no logical debates, and it, and it put people to sleep. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and there were certain attacks that were able to be enacted on the black community under the administration. You know what I'm saying? But again, it was, it was like it was like a uh, like an opiate. You know what I'm saying? People like this is literally getting high with the cats going down. Yeah. I'm with you on that. I I probably was a little part of that for a second, but I opened my eyes, but at the end of the day I think I would have rather the last administration than this administration, but I do understand that one person doesn't rule everything and he's not in charge of everything like it's perceived to be. But this man Trump, in my opinion, can do some some wreak some havoc on this world that people aren't even ready for, and some people are just blindly just aiming in his decisions. A lot of people let have awakened, but it's just crazy to me what's going on with. Well, let, me be, let, me, let me let me let me let me let me but let me be, let me be clear. The masses, the people, the Obama, the, 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 the Barack Obama's a senator in Illinois, where John Burge, uh, 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 the of the Chicago Police Department, was electric shocking. Us with our sex organs in the city. We get dispensed about the projects. We don't we say this, we would be under the attack then. And again, I'm not caught no absolute, I'm not no, I ain't waving no flags for uh, 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 Trump neither. See, we the ones on the plantation. That when, the, when, the, when the question is asked, who you riding with, the South or the North, our position was neither. We, our allegiance is the Harriet Tubman, the Reverend Nat Turner. You know, you know what I'm saying? See, I'm not, I don't, those <laughs> with choices like those who need enemies. I'm not, I'm, again, I'm not, I'm not debating that we, this is an attack, it's a tiss on our people now, but I'm saying it's been attacked, been a tiss on our people, and it's hell yeah, like Richard Pryor saying, huh? Yeah, I was just saying it's, I was agreeing with you on that, but I was agreeing oh, yeah, with you on that because, I was agreeing with you on that because, yes sir, even when Obama was on there, it was like, man, every every week, police was, was, was you know, killing man. one of us, man. and getting away scot-free. So it's no really no situation where I feel that we were safe under any administration. It's always real, been on. Real talk. Real, you know what I'm saying? And, 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 and I think it's important that we uh, we, we keep note. Or you know what I'm saying? Because you know, this stuff, these attacks, this, this ain't just no overnight situation. You know what I'm saying? This is uh, 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 a protracted, long history of attacks uh, been, been on my people. And it's kind of similar like to in Nazi Germany. In Nazi Germany, uh, the term... Uh, Genocide became a word after um, uh, 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 the former Fuhrer of Nazi Germany, Adolf Hitler, and them did it to, uh, to, to the white community in Nazi Germany. That, that the record reflects. With Mussolini, Hitler, and the life, when they would get down on African people, it was, it was a nice term referred to as uh, the African corpse. But for people saying it was a problem when it happened to a certain community. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like the, even like the, the heroin problem. They've been locking, they've been locking us up left and right all through here. You know what I'm saying? Now, you know what I'm saying? You, when white people get impacted by you, some, we need some, some, some uh, uh, sinners to get them healed and so on and so forth. It's kind of like comedian genius Richard Pryor said. White folks ride through our neighborhoods and see black folks out there with dope niggas in their arms and say, that's a shame. But then they'll come home and they fuck them on the front can, a front porch of the can of Budweiser and they say, uh, uh, oh my God, it's an epidemic. So that's all, I'm, I'm, all, I'm, all we're stressing is that we, we definitely in unity and agree that this, 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 this is intense. But it's, it's been intense on our people, you know what I'm saying? And we are like the, we have been treated like the uh, invisible, uh, Ralph Ellison referred to the invisible men, but paraphrase invisible men and women. You know what I'm saying? But now people acknowledge him because, I mean, this dude, this dude ain't cut no corns. He's like, you know, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, uh, so two years back on Nightline, Ted Copper was on, uh, was on Nightline, and uh, uh, George Bush Sr. came out and said, look, we should all this affirmative the backs and stuff. It's a wrap. We shutting it down. Benjamin Hooks of the NAACP came on saying, well, the president's going to reconsider. Bush said, no, you heard what I said to a couple, point blank. I ain't cutting no corners with you. But then if these, uh, uh, these um, uh, uh, individuals come out there and tell us to, 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 
tell us today what's really happening. We should, you know, say ain't no war. It ain't, you know, real war on us. Man, you doing the whole uh, the, the the term that was the whole term uh, post racial society became popular under that under the Obama administration. You know, again, uh, back to my whole uh, the whole knowledge about the drug. You know, say you had. I mean, when, when, when the white sergeant and the uh, uh, police of Massachusetts when he did uh, what's his name, uh, uh, Henry uh, uh, was Henry Louis Gates. I've got his beer. Well, Obama's friend, friend. They invited this white dude for a beer, for a beer party. You know what I'm saying? And it was a whole, it was a whole attempt to negate the whole country, countries about the, about the race, just even acknowledging it. And you know what I'm saying? What they, what they were saying, say, no one has had the battle. We were placed with this as that is to, 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 to negate that. Don't say that the race contradiction still is a contradiction. That this, this one of the issues that this country was based on. You know what I'm saying? You say you don't recognize. No, I'm not a racist. I'm a realist. Let the record reflect. I'm a realist. And I do recognize that so, uh, we, we were bombarded with so much propaganda, so much, you know what I'm saying, uh, 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 more than the Bill Cosby show was telling us, but don't, uh, we made it now. They put a few of these uh, slave success stories up in front of us, say, well, such and such made it. Well, you know what y'all tripping on? Everything cool. Now, you, you, you see a blatancy uh, with the Trump administration, similar to that of the Richard Mill House Nixon administration, an uh, arrogance, a blatancy, but it was, it was, it was again, not, not, it was not, it didn't just start under Richard Nixon, just to start under Trump, it was a current under the John, under, under, under the tenure of uh, John F. Kennedy, you know, you know, all those prior. It was a current under the, uh, uh, the, the uh, William Jefferson Clinton, the Obama, and all the other administrations. You know what I'm saying? This joker here, uh, he, it's a place uh, uh, close to the knowledge he had in Rome. The emperor has no clothes on. He's so arrogant, he took his clothes off. He done told you this was happening. You know what I'm saying? This we, 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 we go, they go into a country, ain't about no democracy. You know, this was, this was, this was, what's happening in Chicago, this was by design. You know, all the murders happening in this city, if it was happening, if you had this amount of white poodles, dogs being killed, it'd be an international uproar. Every day we get 10, 15 murders in the city. Every day. Mm-hmm. Body organs coming up, missing up in these babies all the time. You know what I'm It's been happening. These, 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 you, but you had these politicians, they won't even, won't even acknowledge Chicago. Go look at uh, when having the Sandy Hook. Is that the first time these black children ever seen the President Obama cry? That's the first time they've seen tears come out of his eyes. Babies getting, they've been getting laid down up in the ground and, 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 and body organs took about them every day in this city. You, ain't, you, 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 you barely mention Chicago. People, people all, uh, I heard about this war. It's a war song. We, we add, it's an old saying. to say God created Africans. America made niggas. We add on to that. The man's the machine. Manufactured shot rack. This is done by design. We done by design in the city. They, you know what I'm saying? And, and from the president on down to the local alderman, all the, not only are they denying, when you try to raise it up, they shut you down. They, 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 they ban you from radio stations. They had a assassination system. They had a assassination system put on my life. Straight white was out to shut us up from talking. Exposing us here. Man.